Chapter 3 Glass and Concrete Tiny pieces of materials are called grains. People can make a lot of things from grains of rock, soil, or sand. For example, they can make glass and concrete. Glass The grains of sand on many beaches are made of a mineral called silica. To make glass, people put silica and other chemicals into a furnace. At 1,500 degrees centigrade, the mixture becomes hot, liquid glass. In the past, people called glass blowers blew air through a long metal tube into the liquid glass to make glass things. Today, most glass is made by machines, but some people still blow glass. They mix colors with glass to make beautiful things. From about 1900, people invented new ways to make things like flat glass windows. Today, there are lots of types of glass. The glass in some sunglasses becomes darker in the sun and lighter in a room. Some glass is very strong. At the Grand Canyon Skywalk in Arizona in the USA, you can walk on glass. Long, thin fibers of glass are called fiberglass. People can mix fiberglass with plastic to make things like boats. Fiberglass is good for insulating things. Hot and cold don't go through fiberglass. People use it in special clothes for very hot or cold places. Concrete Cement is a material that's made by heating grains of rock and clay. When people mix cement with water, sand, and stones, it becomes a liquid called concrete. After a few hours, crystals grow inside the concrete and it becomes a solid material. About 2,000 years ago, the ancient Romans used concrete to make beautiful buildings like the Pantheon. The dome is made of concrete. Later, people forgot how to make concrete for more than 1,000 years. Modern concrete was invented in 1756. Today, it's the world's most important building material. Concrete becomes hard very quickly, so machines only make the concrete when people need it. To make concrete stronger, people put long pieces of steel in it. This is called reinforced concrete. Many of the world's tallest skyscrapers are made of reinforced concrete. Huge machines called pumps move liquid concrete hundreds of meters above the ground. Today, there are many different types of concrete. Waterproof concrete is great for building bridges. Another type of concrete has materials in it that take dangerous chemicals from the air. In the future, this will help to make cities cleaner. Discover! When concrete is mixed with glass, it becomes transparent. 